I'm just like so embarrassed at this point. It's really like, I don't know. It's... Okay. Who's, ah! is it so? vlog and happy vlogmas day one. Oh my god i can't believe it's vlogmas i feel like we just like finished up vlogmas 2020 um so welcome back we're doing 25 days of vlogging till christmas if there is no mental breakdown we'll consider it a success um so i am actually going to be in la up until december 25th going back home to toronto december 26th so there is so much fun stuff planned for this vlogmas your girl is triple vac I just got my booster a few weeks ago, so we are booked and busy, baby. I am so excited. So, got my vlog, my sweater on. Thank you, Alicia Marie. Got my Christmas tree up. Um, I have all my Christmas decor out to do some more decorating. I think tomorrow will be decorating day. I want to run to Target, obviously, as the basic bitch vlogmas bitch that I am. So we'll go to Target tomorrow and grab some more holiday decor, decorate the house, and I know that you've been waiting for this. We've got a Mr. Bubby Bear right here, Mr. Bubbies of the Bubby Hello to Bubbies. Welcome to the 2021 Advent Calendar for Dogs! So this one is from Costco, and if you didn't watch last year's Vlogmas, this was basically the highlight of Vlogmas. Amidst COVID, we couldn't really do much, and this was like the excitement. Uh, of the month. So this thing is, hello! Oh my goodness, are we so excited for the Vlogmas and the advent calendar? So we've got Jingle Bars, Merry Munchy Mix, Gingerbread Person, Lumps of Coal, Turkey Jerky, Beef Jerky. She is thick. I know Moose is gonna be really upset on the days where he gets a tennis ball and a cotton rope and he will be much more excited about the Merry Munchy Mix. So on days where it's like a toy day, we might have to save some of the extra treat days because he is not gonna be happy. Stay tuned for that if you're new to my Vlogmas. This is is like a daily thing that we do every day up until Christmas and Moose is hyped. Oh God, terrible, terrible up angle for the chin, for the double chin situation. Okay, whatever. Oh my God, so sorry, Bubbies. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm so sorry. Mm, I'm so sorry. Uh, so yesterday, Remy, Ollie, and I filmed a trying holiday cocktails and Christmas shots. And for the video yesterday, because we filmed at night and I wanted to have like a fun little Christmas moment in the back, look at these string lights. You can't see them at all, I don't think, right now. But I'm going to turn them on and I'll show them to you again tonight when it gets dark because they're so fucking festive and cute. So I had two, they're like, uh, uh, like hanging lights. So there's like a thingy at the top here and then it, they all hang like string. Is it like a string? It's like a string light garland. So anyway, so I had two of them going all the way across here. Took this one down because it was like very, bless you. Took this one down because it was very disruptive. But let's see if you can see these ones still when I turn them on. Okay, ready, ready. Okay, can you see them? There's different modes, three, four, five, Wait, let me just try and find the solid ones. Okay, can you see them or literally not at all? Literally not at all? <laughs> literally not at all. Fuck, okay, we'll circle back on this and I'll show them to you later on at night because they're so cute and so festive. Oh my God, I'm dead, you literally, oh, you can kind of see them. You can't see them, it's great, you can't see them. I'm just like so embarrassed at this point. Actually, you know what? I can't decide if I'm really embarrassed or just like don't, I'm just like past giving a fuck anymore. We're redoing the office again. <laughs> oh my God. The good news is, is that I have a bunch of stuff in the mail right now. So throughout Vlogmas, we've got a new rug on the way. Um, I want to get rid of this uh, chandelier ASAP. Like she's just, she's giving boho and that's not the vibe that we're going for. I've got these shelves installed. I've got a little bit of art going on. Oh, I got this really great knockoff Louis Vuitton bag. Um, let me show you. I bought it off DHK and I think it was like $90, like with the intention of it being shelf decor because like realistically, like that's how much you could pay for a piece of decor at like Urban Outfitters of this size, probably even more. So I was like, let's just roll the dice and see if it's a pretty good knockoff. And to be honest, like I'm not a Louis Vuitton connoisseur, so maybe it's a trash knockoff, but I think it's cute. Oh, bitch. Oh my God, the iridescent. There was a small part of me that wanted to buy the real one, but like realistically, I would never want to put my stuff in like a clear bag, even though it's iridescent, it's like pretty see-through. But it came with the strap, it came with this little like, 
um, um, at not, uh, what, what fabric, it's pro honestly, probably plastic. A little tag, we love a little knockoff DH gate moment. If you ever see this in the background of videos, just know that she was $90 and not like two grand or whatever it actually, no, I think it actually retails for like, 4,500 or something. Anyways, she is wall decor and she is thriving on this shelf. The situation here is really bad. It's really, really bad. It has become my junk room and like staging place for when things don't have a home. It's really like, I don't know. It's, it's really bad. It's really bad. Oh my God, oh my God. So let me give you a tour of the chaos of the mayhem. This will be a fun little project for us over Vlogmas. So new desk, I'm a really big fan of. Um, oh my goodness. Oh, that is a very good sit. So new desk, very, very cute. I think I'm actually gonna spin it around. Um, this is like actually the back side of the desk, but love this, like very fun. Craftopia blankets, Just chaos, chaos, chaos. Here's the other side of the desk. And the chair is actually meant to be on this side because there's like a drawer right here or whatever. So desk is gonna scoop back a little bit this way, I think. And then this will be like the backdrop for the desk. And then I've got, oh my God, this is just a hot mess here. Oh my God. I don't even know, like what is all this in here? I don't even know. Uh, okay, so chaos, chaos, chaos. And the goal I think today is to figure out what I can move from these over to here and see what else like we have to fill in the gaps with. Um, okay, a very flat spooted mousse. This is the old coffee table that was in this room. This is some old decor here. There is a dim sum heating period pillow. Here's a box of other decor. Here's a Squid Game costume that didn't make it in time for Halloween. Here is my Vandy Burger plush, which obviously has to stay because look at him. Mirror plants art is down for the most part. These ones are still up though. <laughs> This coffee table is probably gonna go. It was originally in front of the couch here. The couch, as you can see, is gone. We vlogged that moment um, a few months back. And then this shelf, honestly, it looks really great. But all the sneakers and the books are here. Again, we're gonna try and scoot a lot of those over here, I think. And then this is like a random dress that I wore a few vlogs ago to that green shoot. Oh my God, it is just a hot, hot mess in here. Like I don't really know even where to start. I think I wanna keep these shelves overall. Oh, also, where's the chair? Oh, here it is. <laughs> like where is like all the other things? This is that like really cute, um, uh, oh my god, what's the designer saying? It's a knockoff version, still like pretty pricey, but it's this really cute like single seater, oh my god, the candy corn squishmallow, hello. Single seater like designer looking chair. And so I think um, that's gonna go in that, oh fuck, well I guess the shelf is there. Maybe it won't, oh my god, this is just absolute chaos. Maybe we'll go in this corner here and we get rid of that shelf. Oh my god, this is gonna be such a pro, like this, like, look, can you just like, look at this, it's stressful even just like being near this room because of the just like mass chaos. So that's the plan. I ordered a rug that is a little bit bigger than this and I think because this room is so big, it makes a little more sense to kind of section it off so it's not just like, I tried to figure out if I could do an area rug for this whole room Room, but it would literally have to be so big. And so my thinking is to scoot all of this back here. So this is like the desk side. And then it gives us a little more space on this side to do things. Any advice, if you're an interior designer or just have a good idea, please let me know because this is the hundredth time we have redone this room. So hopefully this is the final one. I've said that also 99 times, but I feel it. It's gonna be a group project. This is the one. Uh, okay. Update, I feel good about four and a half of these out of 15. So I got 15 of these to fill, which is good because I don't want to go crazy. Got this middle one. I literally just picked this up from over there that was right there. So like no creative effort for this one. Got this top shelf that I like a lot. Bubby's entering. Hello, Bubbies. This top one here, very cute. I've got my two dunks, frames, 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 books, sneakers, and cute. Okay, so I feel good about those ones. I say half because I don't know, I don't know about this, but I wanted these two to be like somewhat symmetrical because I feel like the top section is where your eye goes to the most. And also because like I only have those ones done. So I feel good about this top row here. Feel good about this one, TBD on this one. And then we still got a whole shit ton of these down here. Not gonna rush it though and not just Gonna, like buy things to fill the shelves and fill the space um 
for now. Nine out of 15, here we go, not so bad. I'm a big fan of the symmetry situation we've got going on here. Got a little sneaker row happening. Got two big rectangular moments happening. It looks pretty good. Everything else is still in shambles. I literally have not touched a single other thing in this room. And to be honest, I don't know if I'm gonna do any more today. Oh, I'm just like so overwhelmed. I'm like also like, what is happening here? Oh, this is, this is cute, still has to go up. But this little tiny section of my office looks really good. Bubby's entering now. I have all my shoe boxes just here as placeholders currently. I feel like they just like looked so cramped before. I had to order some boxes actually for, oh my God, why is Moose so obsessed with running over here as soon as they start vlogging? <laughs> I had to order some boxes for Christmas presents anyway, so I was like, okay, well, like, can I just do an order of like small white shoe boxes? Because that would just like look so much more cohesive because like some of them have Nike logos on them, some of them are white. Um, that's a New Balance box, that's an off white box, and so like they just like look chaotic. Placeholders currently, and I've got white shoe boxes coming tomorrow to go in these places here. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna be done. I'm gonna do this one here to balance it out with maybe my tie-dye Jordans here so that it feels, cause like if this one's going this way and this one's going this way, I feel like that feels pretty good and I'll have to do something there. Can I help you, sir? We really are struggling. It's been so long since daylight saving started and we are really, really still struggling. <laughs> Fuck, okay, so it's dark out, but I just realized that the regular lights aren't okay. Please hold, please hold, please hold, please hold, please hold. Okay, you're going off, you're going off, kitchen lights off. Just wait, I promise it's gonna be worth it. They're so cute. Ready, okay, lights are off. Christmas! How cow? <laughs> Was this anticlimactic? It definitely might have been. Ugh, I wish that, okay wait, maybe if I can get this to focus here, you can see how cute they look when they're like a little blurred. Oh, cute, cute! Oh my God, cute, 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 and back to normal. Okay, so anyways, this is the Christmas situation here. Jeremy's not super stoked with me, but they're so cute. I've convinced him for all of Vlogmas that they can stay up in the house because I think right here with the lights on should be the official advent calendar opening area as it was last year. And I think it's time. I think it might be time, but is it time? Is it time for the advent calendar? Oh my goodness. Oh shit. Oh my God, Jesus Moose. <laughs> Oh my God, wow. Literally so calm and sleepy all day. So calm and sleepy all day and now just chaos. Do your dogs ever have like crackhead hour? Because I feel like we are approaching crackhead hour for you. <laughs> Do you hear this dog? He's so out of breath. Not that I like can talk shit for having like poor cardio. Okay, the excitement is real. Here we go, here we go. We're in position. Christmas pillow, advent calendar 2021. Oh my God, Logmas, I've missed you. Oh, you have dinner all over your nose. What is this? What is this? Let's do it. Okay, ready? Most will you sit? Thank you, that is such a good boy. I just cut the seal and so I haven't opened it yet. Wow. Oh my God. Oh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Oh my God, this is so cute. Holy shit, this is huge. It's been sold out, I think, for all of November. Okay, sir, 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 day one. Let's see what we, okay, okay. Ah! Only good boys get advent calendars. Oh my God. We got day one, day one, she's out. Sir, sir, thank you so much. Your manners, please. As a child, I feel like I got one piece of chocolate in each advent day. Just gotta say. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 treats in day one. I see we are going to be gaining a little bit of holiday weight this month. I think we'll do like three or four or so. Gentle. <laughs> I swear to God when Moose isn't so, do you need a napkin, sir? I swear when Moose is like not on crackhead energy, he really can take a treat gently. Gentle. Uh, uh, uh. That was so gentle. I missed Vlogmas advent calendar so much. Gentle. Oh, that was so gentle. Mmm, <laughs> felt pretty good, honestly. Not for me. Okay, last one. Gentle. Daddy's is such a good boy. Okay, so I'm gonna save these for uh, whatever day we get next that doesn't have traits in it because Moose will be, he will throw hands, throw paws 
on a day that has a toy and not a treat because those are not one and the same for him. Happy Vlogmas day one, bubbies! He's like, bitch, give me another one. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Gentle dismount, gentle dismount. Oh my God, why are you being... Oh my God! So chaotic. Oh my god, we are in pure crackhead hour right now. Oh my god, danger. I need you to relax. Daily vlogging, daily vlogging. <laughs> I can't even finish the sentence looking at his little face. Daily vlogging is honestly like so daunting thinking about doing it every day because I'm sure there'll be days where like, you know, you feel tired, or you feel uninspired, or you just like, I don't know, I just like sometimes you're just like not in a vlogging mood. But I'm so excited for Vlogmas 2021. I've got so many fun things planned. We're doing our small little big bear trip, I think next week. I think we also fucked up and the slopes are not open. So we'll probably just be doing like fun Christmassy things, which also means that we'll have to pack less if we can't snowboard. So anyways, that is next week. We're regardless um, if the slopes are open or not. Oh my God, how are we gonna do advent calendar? <gasps> we'll have to have Jeremy do advent calendar and he can send me a clip on the three days that I'll be gone. Don't worry guys, I got you. We'll figure it out, we'll handle it, we'll get it organized. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed Vlogmas day one. I'm so excited that we are back. Moose is as well. What a fun month. Okay, love you guys. I will see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas day two and for um, every single day for the rest of the next uh, 25 days. Okay, bye guys, love you. Say goodbye, say goodbye.